Good morning, everybody. As you know, the European uh, Council received uh, the message passed on by the Parliament uh, in respect of the agenda which is under discussion and the various points on the agenda. We added another one, of course, because we think that the European Council and all of the institutions at the moment uh, need uh, to uh, look at what is going on in the uh, Mediterranean and uh, at our borders. Uh, immigration needs to be dealt with uh, pragmatically, uh, practically. We need to have pragmatic solutions, concrete solutions. Every day the news uh, comes in of uh, tragedies, deaths. Boats uh, capsizing in the Mediterranean. We need to be realistic here and uh, grapple with this problem very quickly because apart from the points on the agenda, we added uh, this uh, particular request ourselves. All European institutions need to undertake to uh, work towards uh, appropriate solutions on the agenda. There was also the question of uh, Belarus. The uh, European Council is uh, prepared to give uh, a response to that. We called for an immediate uh, strong response uh, because this is uh, a kidnapping, a hijacking. The plane was uh, forced to uh, land in order to arrest a dissident. This is something very serious. It's unheard of. It's unprecedented. Uh, and uh, we need to have an immediate response to that. Uh, some initiatives uh, are being taken along these lines. And we call on everybody, on the authorities of uh, Belarus, to uh, uh, release Roman and Sophia. They should be accompanied to the border and uh, sent back to the place they wish to go to. So immediate release of Roman and Sophia. It is necessary to, for Ikao to carry out an investigation into this And uh, there need to be targeted uh, sanctions uh, for the people responsible in the regime of Belarus and two measures uh, as well to stop uh, overflying of uh, the country and uh, the landing of uh, and overflying of uh, Belarusian uh, planes uh, in uh, Europe. It would be very good if a strong uh, signal were given uh, in Europe in support of Roman because uh, we need to show solidarity. We are looking into uh, questions relating to Belarus. And uh, the question of uh, the opposition in Belarus has been uh, looked into in the Parliament. Now, apart from these uh, subjects, uh, there's uh, the question of climate change, which will be looked at this morning by the Council. An appeal has been made to the European uh, Council. It's a political body. It's uh, not a co-legislative body. The uh, 
Parliament is that body, as is the uh, Rotating Council. But uh, we don't want uh, any interference in the uh, negotiations which are going well, and we hope that uh, those negotiations will end by the uh, beginning of the summer. The European Council is uh, used uh, to um, interventions, uh, but uh, this wouldn't be appropriate. Uh, at the moment, uh, the Parliament and the uh, Portuguese presidency are uh, working well together. And as we've shown in the past, with the COFB, the legislative powers are competent to carry out their work. I think that uh, constitutes the assessments we have made, the appeals we have launched, and we hope that uh, uh, the climate uh, conclusion